In this video, we are going to discussing about budget management in Auto 13 accounting. So, the budget management is a very important thing for any business organization. Using the budget, we can analyze the analyze the performance of our company by comparing the actual amount we spent and the planned amount. We can plan an amount for the budget, or we can plan any budget and for that we are entered to the accounting module and you have to configure the budget inside the general settings at the end of the general settings we can see the analytics we have to enable the option analytical accounts and the um, budget management and save this then in the accounting tab you can see the options there there you can see the option budgets and analytical items uh, click the budgets then you can see the budget here and we can create a new budget from here by clicking the create button and here we can see the budget reposition and the budget lines note that uh, here we can see the analytical account it's not mandatory but for proper working of the to know the proper working of the budget you can you have to uh, give the analytical account there to know more about the analytical account please check the link above there's a block for analytical account and inside that your describe it very detailedly we can come to our topic then here we can see we can give it any name here so we are making a new branch so this is the budget for the new branch and here is the responsible and the period this is the period we were using the contract or the budget so this is for the one year 1 to December 30 so this is a one year budget and we can see we can add it and the budgetary portions the budgetary portions are the other list of accounts for which you want to keep the budgets and typically it's in a expense or income account and then we can create a new one here and here we have to give any name for this which is uh, as you want and here you have to specify the account that is a expense or income so we are creating a new account code demo and type is income and then you can save this and here we can see the tab for analytical account if we want to use it use it here you can specify it and the start date and the end date of this budget and the planned amount the planned amount is the amount that you have to plan the plan for the budget so We are planning for 24,000 and then here we can see the practical amount the practical amount is the amount that how much amount you can spend in that budget or the amount that we spent practically and the theoretical, theoretical amount is the is representing the money you can theoretically use or the, you can use 
and uh, achievements which are personally between the track tail amount and tail tail amount and by confirming by confirm you can see a tail tail amount is from here it's by day to day amount we can spend and it's the date and we can approve it and then we can make it as done so we created the budget and we are using it by creating an invoice with the let's work the work and the account we created how to use the account here let's demo and if you have any analytical account specify it here and the price we are using is 100 and post this and validate then inside the budget you can see the practical amount and the theoretical amount here and the achievements the and we can see the budget report at the budget analysis in the new branch we can see the detail of the amount we used if there is an analytic account it will be here and inside the analytical account or analytical items we can see the journal there this is how the budget is managed in the auto 13 accounting module and thanks for watching this video if you are interested in knowing more about this or looking for any Odoo implementation or customization in your business, drop your request to info at cybrosis.com.